In this video, we are going to cover how to configure your orange blocks to make them explode. You will need to update your app to version 2.7.2 .2 if you haven't already. To get started, open the game builder and select a game you would like to edit, or create a new game. In the game builder, select the block tab, the tab on the far left. Click on the orange block in the tab to select it, then click anywhere on the grid to add it to your game. Click on the configure tab, the center tab with the wrench icon. This enters config mode. Now that you're in config mode, click on the orange block. There are two types of action blocks. To change the type to exploding, click on the right button underneath the orange block art. These are the default settings of the exploding block. We will change these later. For now, let's test the new block. Exploding blocks will blow up when they come in contact with enemies, green blocks, orange blocks, and red blocks. Exploding blocks will destroy other exploding blocks. The explosion will cause a chain reaction. You can change the amount of damage the explosion will deal. You can also make the explosion deal damage to the hero by checking this box. <laughs> to create a wall that can explode, we will need to add a door trigger. Click on the trigger tab, the one on the far right, and select a door trigger. Add a door trigger to the orange block of your choice and set the key code to whichever key code you aren't using in your game for the best effect. I'm going to use key code D. This will lock the exploding block in place and the hero cannot push it. However, it can still be removed by an explosion.